Well, he promised a bombshell that he claimed would take down Detroit Mayor Mike Duggan. Right, but in the end, businessman Robert Carmack delivered anything but in a lengthy and bizarre news conference at his Detroit auto body shop. Defender Kevin Dietz is here now. Kevin, correct me if I'm wrong, but right now it seems like all he's got is really just a major axe to grind with the city. Yeah, a lot of noise today, maybe not so much news. The crowd wanted gotcha video of Mayor Duggan. What they got was old city council meetings. Bob Carmack says the video may not be salacious, but insists it proves the city swindled him out of millions of dollars worth of riverfront property. And now he's asked the FBI to investigate. Bob Carmack played clips of old city council meetings when everyone was expecting gotcha video of Mayor Mike Duggan caught in the act. The information extremely embarrassing to me would be released by Carmack this coming Wednesday. With the implication of that threat, we immediately reached out to law enforcement. Earlier, Carmack released video of the mayor going to a woman's home in the suburbs. The mayor telling the state police Carmack would release more if the city refused to settle a property dispute in Carmack's favor. Today, Carmack responded, not with salacious videos, but with what he calls proof the city sold a multi-million dollar riverfront property that was rightfully his, just as plans for the new Gordy Howe Bridge emerged. Bob Beckman from the FBI, he got the same files. He got these same tapes. And guess what? He knows what they did. What this is is just corruption. Carmack says he has more embarrassing videos of the mayor, but will not release them until after he talks to the state police. His attorney says Carmack will not be silenced. What is troubling is that we bear witness to a thin-skinned public official who is threatening to utilize the services of the Michigan State Police to shield himself from public criticism. Mike Duggan is an elected official, and whether he likes it or not, his conduct is subject to public scrutiny. Is he bluffing? Who knows? Today, the mayor's spokesperson said, quote, it's hard to tell why he called a press conference to show mostly old city council sessions. There really was nothing new he said that's worth commenting on. So no new comment from the mayor's office, which maybe yeah, is a good thing. Yeah. Bizarre. So yeah. you've got a special report coming up at 530, and Carmack is going to play a role in that as well. Tell us a little bit about that. Yeah, this is a lawsuit that Carmack has about a building of his that was demolished. But what's interesting is there was a deposition taken, and one of the big bosses, Jim Wright, in the demolition division uh, he was under oath and on video and he was asked several questions about the FBI investigation into demolition uh, a story that's been uh, brewing for a couple of years yeah, now yeah. we learn some what the FBI is up to yeah. okay we'll see you then yep. All right, Kevin.